Hey, what's going on? It's your boy Big Ground representing CNL Lewis Enterprises. Um, right now, I'm just going to show you how to make a quick uh, instrument in Native Instruments, Reactor Five. Um, this is the interface, and this is pretty much the inner workings of the software. So, I'm going to go ahead and start with that. Here's your instrument. Right now, the default it wires up to the ins and outs. If you had an effect, then this would be your input of mic, go and wire to your effect, and then wire back to your outs. But since we're just going to do an instrument, we're going to delete the inputs. Double click on the instrument. As you can see, it's empty. I'm going to move this over to give me more room. I'm going to start with a macro. So you right click, go to macro, uh, building blocks, oscillator. And I'm going to start with the oscillator. Um, that has three waveforms, which is the oscillator three wave. Wire that to my left and right. I'm going to go ahead and put in my um, my pitch, my note pitch, and my gate, which I right click built in module, MIDI in, and then I choose note pitch, and then do it again and choose gate. All right, because I'm going to need that. I'm going to go ahead and wire my note pitch to my pitch on my oscillator. So go ahead and double click on the oscillator three wave. As you can see, we have three waveforms. I'm going to give us more. There's your three waveforms. Going to give us more. Basically, you go over here to the wave selector, right click properties, and as you see right here, it says minimum port groups, which means that's be the minimum of import selectors that you want. Um, it says one, but we're going to make it five. That way we can add two more waveforms. So we go over here, right click on built in module, oscillator. And we're just going to choose um, two oscillators that we don't already have. So I'm doing impulse, right click, built in module, oscillator. And I'm going to choose noise. All right, so we just wire them into the two extra imports, select this right here. Then we're going to wire this to a pitch. This is where our note pitch is, is actually wired to. So we're going to, this is like a splitter. So we're going to go ahead and wire that to that. So wire from the splitter to the pitch right here. And this one doesn't have a pitch on here. So we're just going to go ahead and wire to here, which is our, um, this is where our envelope is going to be connected to. Um, then we're going to rename these imports right here because it just says N. I'm going to go right click on that, rename port, and name it whatever the waveform is. Right click here, rename that noise. Alright, so we added two more waveforms, which you can add as many as you want. If you look at my other tutorial on Reactor, it shows you how to use um, samples to make waveforms. And if you, once you add that, I mean, the, the possibilities are endless. So you can actually add that too, but I'm not going to do that today. Just watch the other video and show you how to uh, do that. So double click on any empty space to take you back out. Now we're going to put in an oscillator. I mean, not an oscillator, an uh, envelope. So I think I'm going to go to which one I'm going to use. I'm going to go click, go to Micro Classic Module, then go to Classic Module 6, LFO and Envelope. Then once you go there, go to Envelope Dash ADSR. Click there. <clears throat> now we're going to connect their oscillator to the envelope just click on that where it says a and go into the out to here then we're going to wire a gate to there and you hit the key you should hear sounds go ahead and turn that up all right so if we go and look at an interface just double click on any empty space there it is we click here to move our stuff around okay so here's our oscillator and here's our envelope just click 
We're doing this again, so it'll stay still. It has a... Huh. wonder why that's not working. False is not working. Double click here. Okay, I didn't wire it to the envelope. If you don't wire it to the envelope, the uh, sound won't work. So make sure you do that. <coughs> Double click on any space to go back out. And there it is. Now, <coughs> the one thing I like about Reactor is it's so much. E it's so easy to add on extra oscillators or envelopes um, if I wanted to all I had to do is just circle the section right click on it duplicate boom got another one and just rename it oscillator one oscillator two that way um, you won't get them confused but it's that easy to come up with new oscillators or anything they make it real easy for you um, you can add on the filter right click Let's say I go to filter, building blocks, filters, um, four pole. I wire my, from my P to my note pitch. Wire this into my oscillator into the input of the filter. Wire the outs into my outs here. And now it's going through my filter. Can get more creative at a LFO. Right click, um, right click, filter module LFO. Oh no, let's try a different one. Let's go uh, macro, classic module, and then LFO. No, it's not the one I was looking for. Macro. Building blocks, LFO, yeah, then LFO. Go ahead and wire that into the PM. And that kind of give you the wobbly effect on the filter. All you do is turn the wheel up, which you can actually learn that button to go on your wheel. And then turn the modulation up. Um, <clears throat> the same way I added more oscillators, um, waveforms to the oscillator, you can double click on your filter and add more filters. Um, your four pole, for some reason, come with six, but they only use three. All you do is right click on that selector, properties, minimum six ports, and just wire them. Boom. Right on over it, automatically you got six more filter types. Like I said, for some reason, you go ahead and right click on here and rename them, but I don't have much time, so I'm not gonna do that. But it gives you now six filters instead of the three that you had. And that's all the time I have now. I'm going to make another video, kind of show you more in depth, and continue from where I'm at right now. All right? So stay tuned, part two. Peace.